Hello and welcome back to Fighting Irish Extra. I'm your host, Catherine Dudas. Spring break has come and gone. South Bend is a balmy 45 degrees and Irish sports are heating up as well. It was a huge weekend for Irish hockey who upset top seed and second ranked Boston College in the quarterfinals of the Hockey East Tournament. How about them apples? The Irish came out flying a Friday night and matched their season high in goals with a 7-2 victory. They had a bit of a letdown Saturday falling 4-2 but bounced back to clinch the series with a thrilling 4-2 victory Sunday afternoon. Brian Russ scored on a wicked hard one-timer in the final seconds of second period to put the Irish ahead. Stephen Summerhays came up clutch with 30 saves to shut the door on the Eagles. The Irish will be shipping back up to Boston to face UMass Lowell in the semis on Friday. Women's basketball was rewarded for their undefeated run through the regular season and ACC tournament with a number one seed in the NCAA tournament for the third straight year. This marks the 19th consecutive tournament appearance for the Irish who will face 16 seed Robert Morris on Saturday in Toledo. Men's lacrosse continued their strong play in their first year of ACC action with an 18-9 blowout victory Sunday over number seven Virginia. Sophomore Matt Cavanaugh was all over the score sheet, racking up four goals on two assists on the day, while junior Nick Asello contributed his first career hat trick. The Lack squad next faces Ohio State on Tuesday. Notre Dame softball is coming off a satisfying 9-5 win against Virginia Tech on Sunday. In the final game of the weekend ACC series, Notre Dame mounted an offensive frenzy with 14 hits and 9 runs, 5 of which came in the top of the 6th inning. This win puts the number 22 Irish at 19-7. The team is scheduled to host Pittsburgh in its first to ACC series next weekend at Melissa Cook Stadium. Baseball was able to bounce back after a tough weekend to pick up a win against Robert Morris last night. They shut out the Eagles 3-0 while only allowing three hits. The Irish picked up their three runs in the third. Prior to that, it was another close ACC series loss to Duke. On Friday, they actually took the Blue Devils to 10 innings, 4-3. Kevin Biggio had two hits and two RBIs in the game. On Saturday, they continued to play Duke tight, dropping one contest 1-0. Remember to like us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Fighting Irish. Follow us on Twitter at Fighting Irish and follow us on Instagram at The Fighting Irish. Thanks for watching The Fix. I'm Kathleen Dudas and as in all things, go Irish.